Hello everybody, welcome back. Motherwood here. Motherwood here once again with Minecraft Survivalist. Welcome. We are in a hole in a desert temple. Music is playing. Let's hope that's morning music. Alright guys, let's look at what we've got. Nice shiny armor. That is the main thing we got here. Oh, power one bow. That's awesome. Okay, we'll keep that. We'll try and keep that at least. Must must have killed a skelly and got that. That's great. Okay, there's our inventory. Oh, we need to clear more stuff out. Two diamonds. Two diamonds. Two diamonds. We can make a diamond sword. That is allowed. That is allowed. Diamond sword, people. Diamond sword. We are rocking and a rolling. That's awesome. Now, still got some iron pants, which I don't think we'll need because we enchanted those. All right. We'll need to make. Oh, that'd be right. Pick up the wrong stuff. Oh, what was that? Iron sword. There we go. And the pick. And we'll get rid of sticks. All right. And we need these blocks to get up. Up, I said. So good episode. Last episode. Fully enchanted, fully enchanted everything. Wow, this is going to be a short episode. Midday, midday people. And I actually had something to talk about. Back into the jungle again. Hey, creeper. We are so going to enchant that sword as well. Let's see if we can go around this, around this jungle a little bit. So I better start, if it's midday, I better start talking about what's going on. Today I'd like to talk about my job. Uh, uh, Rex kind of asked me in one of my Battlefield live streams uh, once. So yeah, it's a, it's a pretty interesting job. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say it's not. It's uh, I work in visual effects now. It kind of covers covers many visual effects. Covers many many jobs. You can you can be on set uh, doing the actual filming and be in the visual effects department, or you can be on the the uh, I guess the end of it where they where you do the effects on the stuff that they shot now that's that's the stuff I do so all those before and after um, green screen uh, memes you might see you know Thor just standing in the middle of nowhere and then there's this awesome background behind it. That's the kind of stuff I do, um, and it, 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 it's great fun. It's a great, it's a great, uh, a great trade. Now, it's something. It, it it's kind of hard to get into. Um, you can get into it, but it it just has this. 
it's a bit of a mentality behind it. I mean, you can do a you can do um, a visual effects course, and as soon as you put visual effects on this on the front of that course, it costs you a bundle. Like it's just it's just crazy amount of money that people pay to to learn the trade, um, and the 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 specific if I can get the words today. The specific trade that I do is compositing, the um, so 2D compositing, and we yeah we do the the blue screen stuff. So in visual effects, at least the computer generated side, there's uh, you can do animation um, from animation. Well, actually, before animation, you've got. Uh, making of the model like the 3d grayscale 3d model um, that you see and um, and after that it'll go to animation animation give the the files to the lighters so they'll light the well, let's say a dinosaur they'll light the dinosaur in in the environment so let's say you're standing here you'll make make sure they're nice and nice and well uh, lit so real I guess and then after they're lit it'll come to me to make it look even more real if you know what I mean um, Yeah, so that's got that's kind of what I do, and oh, excuse me. Yeah, that's that's uh, what they do. So people go to school to learn that trade, and it's it's almost something you you can learn, but as much money as you pay, you you're judged on experience. It's it, it's crazy how much. Uh, did the job relies on experience and if you don't get that experience it, it's quite hard to get a job in 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 the visual effects industry so uh yeah it's uh it's it it's it's very cool um when i first started out it was i started right at the bottom uh just working for a place getting groceries and doing day-to-day -day tasks and then we we move on up yeah you know, i just really just hung around like a bad smell until they gave me a job and i worked my way through everything so i got the experience if you know what i mean so uh yeah you so you get you get to know everything that's the main part um so it's it's kind of hard to find these days, but but super fun, and you get to meet lots of lots of very very cool people from all over the world. It's a job you can it's a job you can learn. You can work to travel if you know what I mean. So I can get a job in Sydney, or I can go for a job in. Um, Canada, that kind of thing. Um, just wait for the world to load up here a bit. Loading all those mobs. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, so there's a lot of people. Come on. Hey, that's better. Yeah, so a lot of people uh, work work to play, and um, yeah, it's 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 good. It's a job you can do that, and you get to meet a lot of cool people. 
and experience a lot of cool things and and the money is good also which that's why people can afford to do that always checking where I'm going these days yeah so that's my job um, if you've got any other questions about it uh, leave a comment and uh, yeah the program that I use is uh, Nuke uh, Nuke from the Foundry um, look that up it's a node node based compositing software um, getting into the details here uh, we need to set up camp for the night don't we Oh, this is cool. Nice. Hey, zombie. Can I kill these guys from a boat? Boom. Alright, maybe he will do. Yeah, you can look that up if you want, but uh, it's... Uh, it's very cool. I'm just not gonna say it's it's a it's a cool program oh. in leaps and bounds in in te technological improvements over the over the years. It's just amazing. Oh. Now I forgot to bring up my subscriptions. I know I think I've only had one, so I'm just gonna dig this out and get myself set up. And just pause it so I can go get my subscriptions. There's always something I miss when I'm setting up to record. All right, we've got some iron. All right, we'll pause it there and get my subs. All right, I've got my sub, Joey. Joey was my one sub for this week. So thank you very much for subscribing. I appreciate it, as always. All right, but actually. <gasps> oh no. Oh. All right, all right. What did we leave behind? Oh no. <laughs> we left the enchanting table behind. Oh man, that is. Oh. I don't know where I came from. Back there somewhere. <laughs> oh no. Man. That was. Oh, I'm gonna dig a hole straight down right now <laughs> deary me left an enchanting table in a in a desert temple somewhere all right well time to pick a fight then I guess oh baby zombies this is bad these guys yeah, yeah. Uh, oh. uh, <gasps> oh, I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. I'm running. Away from at least one of those things. say I don't know what to say 
The run has come to an end. A silly, silly end. First. <laughs> Maybe that's what happens when you talk about your job when you're trying to have fun. I don't know. Oh, man. So. Oh. I don't know. Oh, that's my enchanting table. Let's die. <laughs> oh, no. At least it was a... Got beaten up at the end, I guess. Oh, no. That's just... Oh. Well... And I, uh, and I just got all my enchanted gear. Damn it. Oh, all enchanted gear. It's a, it's an omen. It's like, you're going to go too far. Okay, now we're going to throw a witch, two baby zombies, and a skelly at you. Hmm. Oh, dear. All right, well, next week will be another season. Yeah, the boring part where I'm <laughs> hiding, cowering everywhere. So, till then, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.